Good morning, guys. So today is the 3rd of December. We found Cupcake chilling over here in my little coffee spot. She ate one of our donuts, but it was right here. Right, Addy? And Addy ate the donut. <laughs> and Cupcake left her a cute little note. Make a book. Oh, where's Nathan? And she had to use it this only piece. Oh, she used your paper. Nice. Cupcake is so creative. So, they actually slept in the living room today. I woke up with some excruciating pain on my lower back and it's hurting really bad so I don't know how much I'm gonna vlog today what no you have to have breakfast you can't have candy right away uh, I don't know I think I triggered a nerve or something maybe I slept wrong somehow turn that off open the blinds instead oh it looks so cloudy outside Oh, it hurts. I think I'm gonna, um, what was I gonna say? Jeez, I can't think this hurts so bad. I'm gonna do some editing, I think. I'm just gonna put the last two days together and see if I can get it up for you guys today. Oh. I'm trying to like walk off this pain because it doesn't feel like my normal sciatica nerve pain this feels different so I'm just trying to walk it off and see if it'll help but it hurts really really bad uh, I will talk to you guys a little bit later so yeah that's our morning right now all right guys by the time you watch this vlog this second vlog is gonna be up on my channel. Nathan, where'd you go? Daddy. Donde estas? Travieso. He had like the worst stinky poop, you guys. I feel like it's still lingering. You're such a troublemaker. He's always putting stuff everywhere. Like, my house can never be clean. The girls are in their room. I'm just sitting here waiting so I can upload this. My back is itchy. Um, what else? I don't know. It's pretty chill. It's Sunday. I think I already vlogged this morning. I think I showed you guys the elf. I don't remember. It's almost noon, actually. I'm still in my PJs. I didn't end up doing my makeup yesterday, you guys. We watched TV. TV. We watched a movie and went to bed. I'm just sitting here looking at my laptop. Having my boring life flash before my eyes. Nathan's crying because what does he want? He probably wants juice or chips from over there. <gasps> Cute outfit! Where's your shoes? Don't have any yet. Okay. You want me to tie that? Yeah. Would you like me to comb your hair? Okay. Go get me a brush. It's probably on the floor somewhere. Look. I already see it. It's literally right there. You want to pick up daddy's hat too? Okay. Thank you very much. I need to go get dressed too. We should probably start our day since it's literally almost noon. Hi, huh, Addie. Yeah. Yeah. We're gonna plan on doing the advent calendar soon as soon as I get this video uploaded and then we're gonna get ready for the day. I'm going to see what project, not projects, what supplies I still need. I gotta go through my crafts. Nathan is over there humming and being squeaky. That backlighting, I'm sorry, it's like making it look foggy. Anyways, um, I don't know, you guys. <laughs> All right, I'll just check in with you guys a little bit later. So now you get great. I'm getting ready to set up and film. I'm watching Amy Macedo right now. I'm over here trying to make myself look decent. I'm gonna go fill my cup, get some water, PJ pants. All right, guys. I ended up getting my Starbucks cup, and 
This is how I'm going to film right now. Yeah. Uh, I just threw on a t-shirt. Obviously, you're not going to see my pants or my feet, whatever. So, I'm going to stay in PJs. And this is my setup, you guys. Um, nothing fancy. I film in my bedroom in a little corner. I still have, I'm listening to Amy Macedo. Have my fan on because it's hot. What else? Okay, so just on some lashes. I'm wearing the bold face makeup lashes. Let me pause here for a second. I like to just play some of my favorite YouTubers while I do my makeup. Because I think this one that I'm going to do is just going to be like a speed through one. I don't think I'm going to talk in it. And then I just have stuff still up here that I haven't put away. So that's really basically my setup I was just gonna show you guys this is my little tripod thing where I put my camera and my glitter background it's just fabric I mean it looks super ghetto but it works I actually get a lot of questions about my background it's pretty close to me right now I don't always have it this close to me it just depends on how I set it up it's such a pain in the ass to set up Normally I need help because I got to like put the legs on it and stuff. Julio actually built it for me. And it was pretty affordable. I've added a couple of things. I don't know if I ever showed you guys again since the last time I did my makeup collection. But these two are new. And if you guys are curious, I do have a makeup collection video on my channel, and I made these two. And that's from Claire's or Icing. I think it's Claire's. This damn shirt shrunk on me, you guys. I'm so upset. It was, like, oversized. And I knew I shouldn't have put it in the dryer, but I did anyways. And it, I mean, it still fits me. It's not super tight or anything, but... I liked how oversized it was. I'm going to probably check the website on Rue 21 just to see if it's still on there because I really like it. I just, I don't know, graphic tees like this, I like them to be oversized. So I'm going to clean my face and decide what kind of makeup I'm going to do. I don't know if I'm going to do a full drugstore look, if I'm going to do high end, high end and drugstore. I want to do a holiday look. I don't know. We'll just see. I've been wanting to do my makeup for the last couple of days. I just honestly don't. I don't know what look I'm going to do. I feel like it's too early to do holiday looks, you know? Like, I like to do them a week or two before Christmas and New Year's. But I just want to do, a, like, a full face of makeup. I have nowhere to go. I haven't gone anywhere other than the grocery store, which was yesterday. And I didn't even have makeup on, so I don't know. I'm just in the mood to do my makeup. And I'm just rambling, telling you guys the same thing over and over again. Oh, I haven't even used this, you guys. My Kat Von D brush, I'm going to use it because I have not used it. And I need to. I bought it and I didn't even use it yet. Anyways, I'm just going to let you guys go. I need to figure out what the heck I'm going to do. My eye really hurts, by the way. I don't think I had mentioned it to you guys two days ago. This drawer right here was wide open. Like, bam, wide open. Ignore my trash. But I think it was like this. And for those of you who are new to my channel, I'm blind in my right eye. So I bent down to grab something. And I still had this set up, but it was like way closer because I had it slouching. And when I went down to bend down, obviously I can't see with the right eye. This damn thing was popped out and then bam, I like nicked myself right here. Oh my god, you guys. I thought I was bleeding. I was like crying. It hurt so bad. But it's been two days. I didn't get a bruise, but I can feel all of this like still really, really swollen and it's really tender. It just really hurts. So, I don't know. Oh, uh, you guys. And you know what? Another thing. You would think I would take advantage of filming. Like, these last two days have been pretty chill. And the kids have been pretty decent. Like, they have their moments, obviously. <laughs> but Nathan's been taking his naps. The girls are occupied. It's the weekend. I should have, like, filmed a ton of videos. And I didn't. So, I need to get my shit together and film for you guys. 
I miss doing beauty videos. The last one I did was, the last video I did obviously was Vlogmas, but then before that I did my haul. I did my giveaway video, and then, I don't know what video was before that, but I, I haven't done a makeup tutorial in a while. I need to do it. So, that's what I'm going to do, and I'm going to open this right now, too. Alright, you guys, now I'm really going to let you go. Hey, guys, so I just finished filming this look for you guys. I did two lip options. This, obviously, the more daring, super, super vampy one. This is the madness, the aftermath, basically. I have so much shit everywhere. And now I gotta clean it up. It's like I clean it so that I can just make a mess, basically. But now I'm comfy. I'm still in my PJ pants. But yeah, I'm kind of digging this lip. <laughs> Anyways, I'll talk to you guys a little bit later today. Okay guys, so it's time to do a craft. We're going to be doing the advent calendar. We have a whole bunch of stuff on the table. The girls are here. Nathan was just here. <laughs> You're going to need 24 toilet paper rolls. As round as possible. You're going to need scissors, a sharpie, pencil. If you have a pen or a different type of marker, that's fine. You're going to need some type of glue, and this is just, well, if I can not drop it, some regular house, some, this is just some regular school glue, tissue paper, or any type of construction paper, because you're going to need to cover the front of the toilet paper roll, and then this is just that paper that comes in the Sephora boxes when you order online, so I always keep that. Another thing, if you don't have these laying around, you know, you can probably use something else. But the reason I already have so many is because I save these all year. My girls do a ton of DIY projects with these all the time for the holidays. <laughs> for the holidays and also just year around. We're, we're constantly doing crafts with these, so I always save them. You're going to need some type of ribbon. It does not matter the color. I never go out to the store and purchase anything for this particular craft. I just use what I have at the house. And I already had these. This one I actually just got at Walmart for a dollar. So it might come in handy for this project. I have paint in that basket, but I don't know if we're going to paint these yet. You're going to need some hot glue sticks and your hot glue gun. Also, if you have any type of embellishments that you want to decorate the advent calendar with, you know, anything Christmassy, whatever, it's up to you. The sky's the limit. You can do it however you want. I do it pretty basic with the kids. Make sure you're helping them, especially with the cutting of the scissors and the hot glue. And hopefully this inspires you guys to get crafty with your kids. And, oh, also, you're going to need candy. I just have a bag of, like, random Halloween candy and then some candy Addie got the other day at a parade. So there's some candy canes in there, too. So whatever candy you want. And if you can use things you guys have at your own house, then do that. This shouldn't cost you a whole lot. It's just a simple DIY Christmas advent calendar that's fun for the kids. Today is December 3rd already, so they're going to be getting extra candy today because we didn't do this sooner, and I'm just trying to adjust the camera.
So the girls are going to end up painting all of these and while those are drying, I'm still, I just finished cutting, I just finished cutting out 24 of these. I'm about to number them all and then hopefully they'll be dry because it doesn't take very long for those to dry. And then we will start assembling them afterwards. So Olivia's over there watching cartoons. She stopped painting, Addie just finished, and we're going to let them dry. I have to start dinner. We got 12 of them painted because we're going to just do the outside ones. And we're going to let these dry. I'm going to start dinner and then after that I'm going to finish the project with them. So. Tonight is tacos. I have the mini tortillas. I'm gonna cut up some onions. These are tiny and I love onions, so I'm gonna do four. I'm gonna use some lime to season some of the meat. I'm gonna be having my veggie crumble things. Julio wanted real meat, so I'm making him ground turkey. Have some queso fresco, cilantro. I gotta double check if we have salsa. I need to drink more water. <laughs> But uh, that's what I'm making for dinner tonight. I gotta hurry up. I think he's gonna be home in about 20 minutes. What? Do glue I know we're not doing glue yet. It's later. And yeah, that's what I'm. That's what I'm making for dinner. So I'll probably show you guys a little bit. Uh, I'll probably show you guys everything once it's cooked because this is a little bit more of a process and I gotta hurry things up. So I will talk to you guys later <laughs> so this is what i have going on right now i cut some cilantro limes that's my veggie meat i got the onions going and then that's julio's ground turkey a little tortillas so everything is coming along i think i'm gonna finish the advent calendar because the girls want to play in their room while these onions cook, I'll put it together. Okay guys, so this is what it's looking like right now. Let me show you. This is what it looks like right now. And I like how it doesn't look perfect because it just makes it look more artsy, craftsy, and like homemade, which I actually really love. And this is what it looks like if you paint it. I mean, you can paint it whatever color, you can leave it alone. But now all I'm gonna do is take some of this ribbon and wrap it around, kind of make a bow at the top so that I'll be able to hang it on the wall. Addie has the candies over there separated. She's gonna put them in and basically they're gonna go in through the back. And I would let this sit so your glue can totally dry overnight and then put the candies in in the morning. And then all you're gonna do every day, obviously, is cut a little hole and take your candies out. So I'll show you what it looks like when I'm done. Time to eat, and then I'll show you guys the calendar in a little bit. How good do my veggie meat tacos look? Enjoy your animal. <laughs> oh, you can see the calendar right there. 
All right, guys, I'm looking pretty fabulous right now. No, just kidding. I'm doing the Bosha pink, <laughs> the Bosha pink peel mask. And if you guys watched my Black Friday haul, I told you guys that I broke out in the welts with the original black peel one. So I'm hoping that doesn't happen with this. And I threw on the entire sample that was in there. Jello. Uh -huh. What do you do? Oh, she spilled it off. So, here's a little close up of the advent calendar. It's really simple, really affordable, really easy. It's a fun project for the kids. And like I said earlier, I like that it doesn't look even and that it just looks homemade. It's just fun. And also, I didn't have to pay for anything. Like, this is stuff we have in our house since we constantly do crafts. So just look around your house, put something together, and it's fun. And then you just fill it up with candy, and then that's it. So hopefully you guys like this little DIY. I put some glitter tool and turned it into bows. And then I crisscross this up here. So it's cute. The girls like it. Julio's watching football because it's Sunday. And that's what men do. Mm -hmm. Right, babe? What? Watching football. Yep. His socks. He took them to work. And the Vikings won today. That's why they won. Yep. That's why they won. <laughs> Okay, you guys, my vanity is clean. I'm gonna take this off. I think it's pretty dry now. I was just on Instagram Live for like maybe five minutes. I was just cleaning my vanity and chit chatting with whoever was on there. Oh, oh there we go. <laughs> so attractive. Man, I think I'm gonna break out in hives. So I can kind of feel it be a little warm where I'm already peeling it. Oh, it wasn't fully dry. No, and I let it sit for a while too. Oh, it's just that little spot. Okay. It doesn't hurt. Can I pull anything? Oh, that's pretty cool. We'll see if I end up breaking out in welts in a minute. I'm gonna go wash my face, take these lashes off. My nose actually looks pretty clean though. So that's good. Okay. I'm gonna go wash my face. I'm gonna end the vlog here. And maybe I will talk to you guys tomorrow. If not, I'll talk to you guys the next day or whenever the heck I vlog. <laughs> so have a good night, guys.